So I'm Dr. Charles Weaver. Uh, I'm a neurosurgeon here at, uh, at Spectrum Neurosurgical, working at North Fulton Hospital. Um, and uh, actually, my grandfather was a neurosurgeon. Uh, and my dad is fond of, uh, of telling me and our family that uh, neurosurgery skips a generation. Um, so I went to, you know, was interested in biology in high school and college and uh, became interested in research, thought that might be something that I would be interested in, in continuing. Uh, and then as I got into to medical school, I really gravitated away from research, just liked working with patients and helping them through their, uh, their, their illness and, and problems and just really enjoyed the idea of helping make people feel better. Probably, probably 80% of what we see is patients with back pain and neck pain. That's just, I mean, I think everyone would agree that's a pretty common problem. Just about anyone who's had uh, any sports related injury can kind of relate to some low back discomfort. Um, so that's probably about 80% of, of what we take care of. Uh, this is a trauma center, so we do take care of a fair amount of trauma, and that includes spine trauma, but also uh, intracranial or brain related injuries. Um, we do see patients with tumors, both of the brain and of the spine and the spinal cord, so we take care of those things as well. I think we have a really a fairly conservative philosophy. Um, try and kind of work patients from the simple treatments that don't frequently don't involve surgery, pain medication, physical therapy, uh, sometimes chiropractic, and then if those things fail then we start thinking about the more invasive things. I mean honestly we have just about all the quote bells and whistles that you could imagine. Um, we use uh, pretty routinely what's called neuronavigation and that's a way of using essentially computer guidance. I like to think of it as kind of having x-ray vision during a surgery. Um, it's a way of uh, taking a 3D rendering of a CAT scan or an MRI scan uh, and it really again puts you kind of inside the, the patient's anatomy and it's that patient's anatomy, not a textbook. It's that patient's tumor or that patient's broken bone that you can see on a screen and use a pointer to be able to navigate. Uh, so that's a, a huge, uh, really uh, exciting kind of technology that, that we use really on a routine basis. He's just so down to earth with his patients. He, he doesn't like talk over your head, he puts you right into the moment with you. Um, and he is so understanding, like he recommended to do surgery and I didn't want to do surgery so he treated me some, with some different techniques and then finally they didn't work and uh, built my confidence up that I had surgery with him. But during the experience with Dr. Weaver, he's undoubtedly one of the most caring. He followed up with me on phone calls after the surgery was over. Um, I seen him in the office and uh, he's never been nothing but kind to me. He's just been, he's a good guy. <laughs>